scroll inside. The hell demands a sacrifice. Is this the sacrifice we're looking for? I think so. This is the sacrifice we're looking for. Let's, um, blitz it. Specialty ammo, 24.8 gram, 0.2175 diameter, measure to be 0.216 diameter. Hollow point, slug. Just recording it. soup, chicken noodle, giving out this hungry vibe. I think the squirrel can feel it. I prefer to kill the squirrel right over there so I can keep my eyes on them. It's dead body. Over here, it rolls down the hill, and I have to pick it up. Or my my dog had to pick it up, which I don't want the dog to pick up the dead body. At the moment, let's just observe. If he ever go back to the the hill in the back. 
it will be his last meal. It's coming off the screen. There we go. What do you, what do you guys think about this um, ATM XI 4K? 3 by 14. And sorry, uh, yeah, 3 by 14 scope. At 1080 resolution. It's pretty good, huh? I think. This will be the longest I ever record with this. It looks pretty good. eating all the peanut I put down. So if you look at the grouping at this distance, we can even take its eyes out if we wanted to. Be yeah, eye shot. But what what is the point to have a some bullets if you shoot eye shots? Am I correct or what? We have to use the full auto. It will only work if it goes back up. <coughs> is it going back up? If I shoot right here, it will roll straight down the hill. About 30 feet. 40 feet hill. Which is not, not ideal. Not ideal at all. So let's, let's wait for it. Go back to the middle. It looks like... A minute ago, it looks like the... can't really tell if it's a male or a female. It's definitely not a full-grown without. It looks like it's a female. It's hard to tell. Could be a male. I mean, at this point, I think we can shoot it even at this at least it's above the hill. It will be a fairly clean shot. We fire right here. The slugs. Let's readjust the point of aim. 19 yards. It's moving down. Let's start new footage. I have to end that video. It was too long. I don't want to cut a video over 11 or 10 or 11 minutes. very tempting to make a shoot shots right now but again we don't want to roll down the hill so let's just stock it stocking this squirrel with Hassan and ATN scope knowing we have we have 21 pellets of slug 21 slugs from Nelson specialty ammo it will turn this squirrel into a hamburger hamburger meat Just let it enjoy its meal. See if we get a chance.
off his hand. Destroy his hand. Or take out the jar. Or take out the nuts off the, the mouth. Or straight into the ear. Or here's the brain. Take the brain out. Or just fire full auto. It will be a, somewhere in the region of here. In this region. There will be no suffering at all. But again, we don't want to roll down the hill, so we gotta wait for it to go back up. Please go back up. is coming and join this party. It's a bird squirrel party. It's a birdie and squirty party. I'm sure here will be a good resting place right beneath the tree. this video going to be, it really depends on where the squirrel lands. We may not get a chance to hit it today. It will be its lucky day. There's a crow just flying by. The bird took off. Two so squirrels just saw the crow. We have eagle, coyote. The crow fly back in. And we have Hassan. Uh, squirrel receive a lot of natural predator. Soup is good. <clears throat> Once this squirrel is killed, it will be fed, fed by the crow, eagle, or coyote, or by the rat at night. So, right now, let's just wait to see what happens if ever it goes back up. If I put the shots in right now, the pellet goes through its body. Through the entire body. Right there. Go from the head to toe. Head to butt. The pellet will fly out his butt. Something spooked it. Something spooked it. Could be a coyote. No, oh, it's a crow. It's a crow again. I think the crow sees him. I don't think crow catches squirrel like an eagle does. Like an eagle do, I mean. 
I believe it's this field with another one. 20 minutes go by, this squirrel's still alive. Well, I should have killed it earlier when, when it was not there. I was trying to see if it goes to right where the meal is. I made a corn and rice meal right there. It was moving around between its two nuts. I tried to place the body right about here. Right here. So I can attract other squirrels. Where are you going, buddy? Where are you going?
three to four birds. It's done. One more. For sure, it's dead. After all, it is a slug. Let me get another camera for a closer look. Slowly zoom in. Right there. It's a pretty good hit. Well, they got hit like. Let me count the pellets. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven minus twenty-one. Twenty-one minus seven is fourteen. Fourteen pellets. A slug. Twenty-four grain. Twenty-four point eight grain. Nelson specialty ammo. Shouldn't suffer. We'll try to crawl away earlier. So when we shoot full auto, because the pellet is moving so fast through, uh, the accuracy is slightly compromised within a half inch circle. Well, originally we'll try to place next to the, the meal, but that's fine. It's still up in the hill. The, the smell of the squirrel was track a lot more squirrel back in, which is good. This is five minutes after. I'm too late to grab the camera. And guess what? Two squirrel came. I don't know how they see it. I really have no idea. The squirrel is basically in the, in the grass inside of this woods and had the cover on it. The squirrel, the crow came down, grabbed the squirrel, and I saw two crows right about here. I think the squirrel body is right behind this, and they drag it away into the air. I really have no idea how crow can see this. It's densely covered, as, and it also was in the pit hole. Just happened. The body is still warm. The cross, I don't know how cross sees it. It's crazy. So, squirrel is gone. Has went back to the cross den and getting eaten right now. But the blood has been spilled on the hill. The sacrificial altar. No blood. Oh wait. Is that... We have blood. On the sacrificial altar. We have blood. The sacrifice we made. One drop of blood. How the hell is the crow seeds the squirrel all the way in there? And pick it up. Now it's all gone. I don't think the crow will come back. I saw it drags away a part of the body into the air. Maybe another half the squirrel still on the ground. But this morning, there was a coyote walk all the way across. So typically after the kill, the body will be gone within minutes, hours. 
no more than 12 hours or 8 hours will be disappeared. But this is very surprising. Well, I killed three squirrel before, all up in that area. All up in this area before, like one tuck all the way back in there and stuff. I just assume it's the coyote went up there and picked them up. But now I think it's the crows. I don't know how they see it. It's densely covered. How is the crows see a tiny squirrel die inside of the woods? Do they have an infrared? Please comment below. Does crow has infrared? I don't think so, otherwise they will see everything all bright, even their own body. How do they see it? It's crazy.